Hey YouTube, Morgan and Scott. Uh, I'm gonna do a video today of opening one of my cans of bacon that I did last week. Um, so it's been just well, it's been like six days now, but it's morning. I'm hungry. I've canned all my bacon, so I can't cook any <laughs> raw. So I'm gonna go ahead and open one and try this stuff out. So um, I'm go ahead and set up my camera here. See, this is my can. I'm just going to bake it in the oven. I've got the oven heated up at 350. And I'm going to lay this out there and do it for about 20 minutes. Okay. Good seal on that. Pull this thing right on out of here. Package. Mmm, smells good. Oh, yeah, it's already cooked. Give me that little piece. See what I'm going to try to just slip that right on over like so. Yeah, that saves a lot of work, but it is kind of just falling apart on here. It's cooked for sure. All right, yeah, it smells great. Uh, so like I said, I'm gonna put this in the oven. I've got it heated up for 350. Guess I'm gonna cook it about 20 minutes. And that'll give me time to make some coffee and maybe heat up some toast or cook some eggs or something to go with it. But, uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and throw this in the oven. It's hard to do all this one handed. The smell of bacon drives Dingo wild. Alright, let me just set my timer. we go. So, that's the easy way to do bacon. And I can do this for years and years with my canned bacon. And here's some of the leg quarters that I canned last night. I made uh, 15 pounds and it made 9 quarts. So, very cool. Alright. Uh, just wish everybody a happy and safe 4th of July. Be careful out there and keep on canning. Later.